was it out there, Zay? It was good. It was good. It was a blessing. You know, I was a little winded because of the altitude, but it was definitely good. How's recovery gone just from this, the shoulder surgery and everything that you've gone through? So this far, year? so good. It's faster than they expected. You know, a lot of people didn't expect me to be out here doing the things I'm doing right now. You know, I was doing things right when I got out the sling, so recovery's going well. How was your experience at the combine? A blessing. You know, uh, something that I wanted to experience since I was a little kid, so just to be on that type of stage was was a blessing. Did you kind of hang out with him? Hang out with the wide receivers. You talked to Xavier Worthy. Yeah, who was kind of your yeah, I was. Guys? I was hanging with Xavier Worthy. You know, a couple of Texas guys, uh, a couple of Washington guys. I was hanging out with a lot of them. You know, uh, a lot of them boys that we're gonna see on the next level. How much did this opportunity mean to you to get today to be able to work out um, for the scouts? A lot. You're healthy. A lot. You know, just to come out here and see how many people came and showed love and support. You know, I was a little nervous and anxious. You know, I thought I was gonna be out here by myself, probably a couple of people, but you know, they showed real, a lot of uh, support and love. So it just means a lot to me. You got excited with your 40 time. Yes, sir. 442? Yes, sir. 442. Yeah. So, you know, a lot of people, they, they came out here thinking I wasn't going to be able to run fast or probably thought my top end speed wasn't fast enough. So, 44 and definitely ended me, you know, some money in my pockets. What Say, did you expect? You think, how much do you think your speed is an asset to, you know, potential NFL team, whether it be at wide receiver or special teams as well? You said my speed? Yeah. A lot. Uh, you know, that's what a lot of the scouts came out for to see, see me run. You know, they wasn't worried about me getting up under that bench press. So, it, I think it meant a lot to them. How much do you think transferring affected your draft status as opposed to if you wouldn't have transferred? Definitely a lot too. You know, uh, especially playing under Coach Prime. Um, you know, anybody transfer out here and play for Coach Prime, definitely his name whole weight. So it definitely means a lot. How cool was it to have all your guys out here encouraging you? Real cool. You know, uh, like I said, I didn't expect a lot of people to be out here. So, you know, just being able to run these routes and look on the sideline, them boys cheering me on was, was real cool. What was your best, uh, other than the 40, what did, you, what did you do out here today that you do like, hey, I did better than what I thought? I think, I, I think uh, definitely the 40. Uh, you know, I wanted that 4-4, so definitely that. But I think I ran some good routes. Uh, got in and out of my breaks real well. So yeah, I, I got to show them what I could do. How cool was it to have John Matoka thrown to? Today? A blessing. Yeah, shout, out that, shout out that boy, man. Um, last night, they told me last minute, uh, around 9.30 at night, that the other quarterback that we had flaked on me. So, you know, we, my agents and stuff went to scrambling. And um, we tried to get somebody else. He couldn't make it. And, you know, we called him at 1030 at night. He answered the phone and was able to get up here. So big shout out to him. He got a good spot on that ball. You know, y'all keep a lookout for him, too. Did you try to get Shador to do that for you? Uh, yeah, you know, you know how that worked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that worked. But shout out to Shador, too. Is the process still strange to you being major, poke, prodded? Is that weird? I mean, a little bit. But, um, you know, like the combine, you know, it, it set me up for all that. You know, the combine was way more eyes. You know, they yell all that, all the, all the numbers out too. So that was a little bit more weird. But over here, I was used to it since I did it already. Hey, Steve Smith, the, the great Carolina Panthers, he showed you a lot of love recently. Sure. He said he liked your game, he said you put dog like your speed and whatnot. He kind of compared you a little bit to Robbie Anderson in a positive way. What did you think of that love from Steve first? Nah, that's a big blessing for him, man. Shout out to him. You know, uh, I feel like he definitely put a lot more eyes on me. Um, you know, Coach Prime did as well. But, you know, when he compared me to Robbie Anderson, a lot of people from old school said that's why, you know, I'm built like and play like. So <laughs> when I heard that, it made me laugh a little bit. Zay, what's next for you uh, just the rest of this month in preparation for the draft? Uh, you know, probably take a couple of uh, visits, uh, a couple workouts to some to some um, programs and stuff like that. But other than that, get, get back in football shape. You know, I was doing a lot of uh, a lot of combine stuff like 40s and, and L drills and stuff. So now I'm getting back in football shape. Who are some teams that are really showing you some, some love and attention either at the combine or even today? Um, the Chiefs, the Raiders, um, you know, the Jets show some love, the Eagles. So quite, quite a few teams. Anything else for Zay? Thanks, Eric. Appreciate it, Tom. Appreciate it, Tom.